This is your brain, and this is YouTube. This is what happens to your brain on YouTube. And this is what fake tutorials make you go through, but it's not over yet. How's it going, guys? Welcome to my channel. I haven't been uploading in forever, and honestly, I've been having a hard time getting my iPad restored. Like, I caught one of those um, profile certificate things. It was a virus. It affected my battery. And I've been stressing about it for months. And all it took was a simple iTunes restore through my computer. And I was really happy about that. But next came this jailbreak. And it was just very complicated. I tried to use check rain, but it just... It would never work for me. Never. And most tutorials I looked online, they just did not help. Did not help at all. Now, without further ado, let's get into this video. Also, I would really appreciate it if you guys help me out with a subscribe. It helps out the channel. So... What you're going to need is, of course, you're going to need iCloud. It's going to be very important to have, as well as iTunes. And I don't care where you get your iTunes. I get mine from the Microsoft Store. You can get yours from the official site if you wanted, but I just, I'm using the Microsoft Store version. Now, the next thing you're going to need is you want to go to Coolstar. Of course, I'm going to provide you guys all the links in the description. But from here, you're going to have to go to Chimera right here on the left side. And you want to download this one. I basically downloaded it right here. Next thing you're going to need is Sideloadly because you're going to need a sideload. Choose your um, poison here. If you don't want to use this side loader, you can use Alt Store. However, it does. I, I, I couldn't really use this. It just wasn't working for me. Um, side loader is probably your best bet on this. Um, optionally, you can use 3U tools, but I haven't really gotten around with this. So, I mean, it's really good for just browsing your. Um, root file system and stuff but of course you're going to need the jailbreak for that so um with that out of the way you want to open up side loadly you're going to have to put in your apple id information you don't have to worry about getting hacked or anything this is not what that's all about it's just to help sign it but to um you know a after you just Put in your Apple ID information. Well, before you do, you need to select the IPA file. Mine's right here. So this is the Chimera jailbreak. Don't worry about it. With it saying up to 12.5, it will work for the version that I'm providing for this video. You just want to click that. Um, put in your Apple ID information so you can sign it. And... You got to have your iPad plugged in, of course. So when you're ready to start, just start it up and it'll start side loading it into your iPad. Now let's get, let's go to the iPad. All right. Um, there's another thing I want to mention to you guys. You're probably, you're probably going to need to go to your, um, your device management and you want to click on your signed app and you want to verify it like you want to trust it simply just trust it all right just to show you guys my ipad is running 12.5.7 on the ipad air first gen this is my um, model number so if you have this exact iPad Air model, it's going to work smoothly for you guys. So now we go into Chimera. 
And here's the tricky part. You're probably going to end up doing this multiple times, but here's a trick. So when you hit jailbreak, you're going to want to tap it. You're going to want to keep tapping it until you get it. All right. You're just you're going to have to keep tapping it. And hope for the best, you know. And you still want to keep tapping it right until you get to the home screen. Because for some reason, it's just not going to go through. If you just hit it and just let it do its thing. Like, I don't, I don't understand why it does this. But this is how I've been trying to get it to work. Alright, let's see. Let's see if it went through. It went through. Alright. Let's see. Yes. See? If you tap it and it just like turns off right away, do what I did and just keep tapping the screen until you get to the, the home screen. If you guys can't um, get Cilio to pop up, you're going to need to go to Chimera. And you're going to see Open Cilio. And you want to hit that, and then, you know, it'll bring you to it, and it'll simply install it for you. Now that we got the jailbreak installed, we're not done yet. There's still more work to do. So for now, you're going to need to go into Cilio. Then you're going to want to probably go to the search thing. And right where you like you want to type in APT, you're going to want to have to update the APT you're gonna have like a bunch of things you're gonna have to upgrade but you won't be able to yet because you're gonna need to um, update the APT once you update the APT you can upgrade everything else that's in your packages here it's very important if you update the APT file so make sure you update the APT first before anything else because this is what's going to help you function the jailbreak now the next thing we need to do is we're going to have to install app sync but you're not going to be able to find that on here just yet you're going to need to go to sources and you're going to want to go right sorry you want to go right here at the plus sign, click that. Now, what you're going to need to put in is http slash slash apt dot the big boss dot org repo file slash cydia. Make sure you type that in and simply add it, add it as a source, okay? It's going to be very important. Now, you go to search, search for packages, and you want to type in Filza, Filza or Filza, right here, and you want to make sure it's under the repository of the big boss, the source we added. Alright, make sure you install that right over here, and um... I'll show you guys how to install AppSync. All right, my bad. You are going to need 3U tools for this tutorial. So let's go to 3U tools. Um, to get AppSync, we're going to need to go to this site here. I'm going to leave it in the description. And you want to go right here. The very top one here. Download that. Alright. 
Now let's go to 3U Tools, go to Files, click File System User, and here you're going to want to add a new folder. Call it Deb Files because you may need to install other certain dead files in the future. Now that we got the dead files, you're going to want to import, select file, locate that file. So, um, right here, import it, success. Now I'll see you right on the iPad. Okay, so now that we imported the um, AppSync file, now we need to install it. So let's go to Filza. Okay. Now, the directory we want to aim for is go to root. Scroll down to you see var. Oh, sorry. Yeah, go to... All right, var. The next one you want to go to is is mobile. Right here, mobile. Oh, not not mobile software, but mobile. Now you want to go to media. Now we got to look for our dev files right here. And this is it right here that we imported. Simply just click on it, hit install. And as you can see, AppSync Unified Installation Complete. So now you can install unsigned apps onto your iPad. So at this point, your iPad is fully jailbroken to its heart's content all right so I would really appreciate it if you guys could give me a like comment subscribe if, as it really helps out the channel and so yeah so when you um, install um, Chimera onto your device don't forget to go to your device management profile and trust it okay I yeah it took me a while to figure this out but I I did it for you guys cuz I know what it's like having your time wasted and there's just so much fake tutorials out there I can't stress it enough so yeah thank you guys for watching and have a good day um, also, if you guys are interested, you can join my Discord server. I'm trying to preserve everything I care about among every single iOS, you know? Like, even the Tap Tap Revenge stuff, too. Like, yeah, this is just really awesome, cool stuff. And I don't mind if anybody uploads their stuff. Like, you know, this is... My whole server is all about preserving and modding and all kinds of cool stuff. So if you're interested, feel free to join. And I'll leave that down in the comments for you guys, all right? Peace.